Let's grab a quick word with the jubilant trainer, Tunde Ajoy. How are you feeling? Oh, man. Overjoyed. Um, I have to say, a massive respect to Pat Barrett because he made me raise my level as a trainer. Sometimes, I remember Frank said to me one time in an interview that, I mean, in a press conference, he said he shouldn't have said that to the guy because he's winding up. He's, he's, you know, he might, he's going to come stronger. And I, believe me, when Pat said he was going to punch me in my face, because, <laughs> oh, you know, we're friends, you know, it's, it's a sport. But that one statement made me work so hard as a trainer. I have lit, and even today, Ant came in and said, why is your eyes so red? That's because I've been studying all through the night. I thank Pat Barrett with all my heart. And that's the honest truth. Well, look, it looks like there's a lot of respect there. I saw you two embracing for quite a while at the end of the fight. What were you saying to each other? I was saying, I love you, Pat. I literally said to him, I love you. I said, you... If one thing about me, Tunde J, I don't... I don't have no... Hatred, no malice for no human being. All I've got in my heart is love. And I love Pat Barrett, I love Lyndon, and I want the best for them. I've always been that, but as I said at the press conference, it's a fight. It's a fight, and uh, after the fight, I think we saw how much respect there is between me and Pat. You know, we done, you know, in terms of, if you look at it, in terms of demographics, you know, one's from north, one's from south, and we're, we're representing communities. There's a lot of young children in inner cities looking up to both of us. And that is the most important thing. And I thank Pat Barrow again. Well, tell us about your charge, Anthony Yard. How did he do what he did tonight? Fourth round, stoppage. Hard work, dedication, belief in yourself. No cutting corners. This young man works so hard. <coughs> this young man works so hard, day in, day out. You know the story of me and Andy. We've been together from the absolute beginning. And uh, he did everything he was supposed to do tonight. Everything we worked on in training, uh, the composure, the leading with the jab, the rolling, the slipping, the dipping. He done everything. And um, I'm just thankful. So it looks like he's in line for a shot at the winner of Joe Smith against Callum Johnson. How does he size up against those guys? We have to enjoy it tonight. <laughs> we have to enjoy it tonight. We can't. It's just a great night, you know. And um, the focus has to be on tonight uh, and the victory. And uh, we'll all enjoy it, you know. Anthony's family, my family, Samuel Alatobosun Ajayi is in Nigeria. I'm coming home to see you, Dad. Wumi Omomersi Ajayi, Mum, I'm coming home to Nigeria to see you. And this is all because of tonight. And so we just have to celebrate tonight. Uh, and I'll be on a plane to Nigeria. <laughs> Tundi, I think I've got very limited minutes left. I'm just going to leave you with a final statement, anything you want to say, and uh, yeah, congratulations. Take the mic. Go on, take it. All you. Dream it, believe it, become it. Anthony Yard, what a young man. And tonight, his night. Stay tuned. It's going to be a great journey. Thank you very much.